welcome back to my channel thank you so much for stopping by and if you're here for the first time please consider subscribing and turning on your notification as i have new uploads every week now today i'll be showing you how to make this common delicacy in kenya known as kumawiki or collard greens or kales and now let's get started So the ingredients are very simple. You need your skumawiki or you can also add some spinach to it if you want it to be more softer as well. And tomatoes that have already chopped onions, salt to taste and I'm adding beef cubes which is completely optional. I'm just adding it for flavor because I'm not having this skumawiki with anything else just with my ugali. And now let's start with the frying process. So heat your pot or sufuria and add some oil to it followed by your onions and fry them until they're translucent. Once that is done, go ahead to add in your tomatoes and add the salt or your beef cube, which is optional to cook with all these veggies and ensure that your tomatoes are completely cooked and broken down. So one thing that I would like to put across is that when I'm having my skumawiki with a stew on the side, I do not add tomatoes in my skumawiki. I fry it plain with, uh, with salt and onions that's just that so if you are having a stew on the side then you don't have to add tomatoes i find that uh, it makes your plate too busy or too much going on so i do not do tomatoes when i'm having my skumawiki with some stew on the side So once your tomatoes have completely broken down, go ahead to add in your skumawiki and fry them until they are well cooked or to your desire. And once that is done, it's time to plate your skumawiki. I added some avocado to it and it tasted absolutely delicious. I really love skumawiki. I hope you did enjoy this recipe if you liked it please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel as well if you haven't i'll see you on my next one bye bye